Hello, welcome back to my channel. Our today's video presentation is the introduction to limits of functions. Before we continue, please visit my channel for more math lessons and tutorials. Thank you. Mathematics covers a lot of wonderful topics, to name a few, number theory, combinatorics, differential equations, statistics, and calculus. Calculus is a major branch of mathematics that builds on algebra, trigonometry, and analytic geometry. It has widespread applications in science, engineering, and financial mathematics. The study of calculus is divided into two fields, differential calculus and integral calculus. These fields are linked by the fundamental theorem of calculus which we will study later on in the course. The concept of a limit is essential to differential calculus. We see that calculating limits are necessary for finding the gradient of a tangent line to a curve at any point on the curve. Consider the table of values shown here, for f of x equals x squared, where x shows values getting closer and closer to 2, from the left and from the right. From this table, we can say that as x approaches 2 from the left, f of x approaches the value of 4. Also, we can say that as x approaches 2 from the right, f of x approaches the value of 4. In summary, we can now say that as x approaches 2 from either direction, f of x approaches a limit of 4, and we can now write the answer for this limit notation. Let me show you limits using another example. For a given limit notation, we will read this as, the limit of f of x, as x approaches 2, is equal to a certain number. This means, what is the value of y, the function f of x is headed towards 2, as the graph gets closer and closer to x equals 2, from the left and from the right of the graph. Suppose this graph shown is the graph of f of x. Note that there is a hole in the graph of f of x at x equals 2, this means there is no value of y at x equals 2. But this is okay because we are not looking for the exact value of y at x equals 2. What we are looking for is just the value of y, what f of x is heading towards 2, as x gets closer and closer to 2, not the exact value of y at x equals 2. And this is equal to 3, since f of x is headed towards the same value of y from both sides. If ever the values of y are not the same from the left and from the right, we can say that the limit does not exist. What if the value of y equals 1, at x equals 2? Will this change the limit of the function f of x, as x approaches 2? The limit would still be equal to 3, because this is the value of y, which f of x is headed towards 2, as the graph approaches x equals 2. Remember, we are not looking for the exact value of y, when x is equal to 2. Now, if we have a different graph such as this one, we can identify the limit of the function, as x approaches 2 from the left and from the right separately. If we will trace the graph from the left towards x equals 2, we can see that f of x is equal to 1. This is the limit of the function as x approaches 2 from the left, as indicated by the negative sign beside the 2. And, if we will trace the graph from the right towards x equals 2, we can see that f of x is equal to 3. This is the limit of the function as x approaches 2 from the right, as indicated by the positive sign beside the 2. Since the left side limit is not equal to the right side limit, we can say that the limit of the function f of x, as x approaches 2, does not exist. Now, a function is said to be continuous at x equals 2, if and only if, the three conditions are all satisfied. The first
first condition is that f of 2 is defined. In this case, f of 2 is equal to 3. The second condition is that the limit of f of x, as x approaches 2 exists. The third condition is that the limit of f of x, as x approaches 2 is equal to f of 2. Therefore, the function f of x is continuous at x equals 2. In our next video, we will discuss some rules for limits. Thanks for watching this video. Don't forget to hit the like and subscribe buttons below. Also, click the bell icon to get notified when I upload my next videos. Please share this video with your friends. Have a nice day.